Hey, what's up, 180 Fit? I absolutely love day two for a 30 day challenge. So, yesterday we talked about listening to our thought patterns. So hopefully, you got some of those down. Today, we're going to be talking about identifying your why. And you've probably heard people talk about their why. Um, do you know what yours is? It's a key part of your journey. The decision to lose weight may seem like one you make that's a, with like a rational mind, but in reality, it's one that you're making with your heart. True and lasting motivation always comes from your heart, not from your head. And a deep, heartfelt desire goes a long way to a lasting and sustainable weight loss. So motivation varies from person to person. It may be a desire to look good um, or maybe more of a negative one that stems from fear, such as the threat of heart disease or type 2 diabetes or now like COVID, right? The results from just being overweight and obesity. So why are you interested in losing weight? This is important. You can't miss this one. Are you tired of changing half a dozen times before you feel comfortable leaving the house? I get that. Been there. Are you concerned about your health? I get that. Been there too. Do you want to get in shape? Make two lists as to why you want to undertake this journey. Be honest with yourself. Make a physical list, okay? So you can place it somewhere visible. It could be in your car, on your fridge, in your bathroom mirror. And take a look at that list before you exercise. Look at it before you make dinner. Reference it often. Okay? That is like, that's like your Bible right now. Okay? Those who have a solid motivation and keep it in front of their mind for life enjoy lasting weight loss success. So you're going to make a, and then I want you to make a list of all the negative consequences for not losing weight and a list of all the positive consequences for losing weight, okay? Because we know that no matter what we do, we're positive and negative. And if we have like those lists in front of us, and then I'm going to also give you something else that I learned. Um, this is a Dean Garziosi, if you follow him at all. He totally radically changed my mindset and the way that I feel a lot of things in life. Um, just He was the first one I ever really heard talk about him and um, Tony Robbins just this past year. And he has something called the seven layers deep, okay? And when I did this, I was shocked because I, like, I always thought I, like, knew my why. I always knew, like, why I start my business? Why do the things I do? Why? I thought I truly knew my why. Um, and what you do is you simply, like, why do you want to lose weight? Well, I'm tired of having a puffy when I go up the stairs, right? Why, do, why are you tired of that? And you ask yourself why seven times, okay? What happens is, Round number four, you move from your head to your heart. And you need to do it seven times. Force yourself to get to that seventh one. And you're going to find your ultimate why. And you might be really shocked as to what it is. I know for a lot of us, it goes down to something like from childhood and stuff. Something that we've defined for our lives that it wouldn't be like something or we're determined to make it be something because of a struggle maybe as a child. So take time today. Make sure you do your seven layers deep that. Make sure you put your list, like put that visual thing in front of you. Uh, I'm, I'm serious. Like reference it. Make sure you have a place where you can reference it and make those positive and negative things. Because we have to have that because there's kind of things in front of us and we need to surround ourselves with it and make copies of it and put it everywhere, honestly. I know I did that. And, you know, I have some things that I'm working on changing my life right now. So I'm planning on doing that with some other things too. So, you know, I'm living this out with you guys. Um. You know, we all have things and times that ways that we can get better and become better humans and just better to ourselves. Um, you know, I think this the COVID has thrown us all so off, just sink and everything. I know i um, just trying to get back into my, like, flow of just even the flow of my days and stuff. I feel like I've been just really off sync. Um, and so for me, I'm doing this as well. But don't just, don't just listen to this. Like, this is something to do. If we were together right now, I'd have us do it right now together. I mean, do it now. It doesn't take that long, but do it. You have, this was five minutes. Take another five minutes and get it done. I'm going to, and I invite you to do it with me as well. All right, so get this done today. Yes, I hope you look, look at those thought patterns. What are the things you're thinking? What, what are those thoughts you have? Right, and then today we're getting our, our deep why. All right, so two things. They're already life-changing. Get this. And it's going to make a difference. I guarantee you that you don't have to you don't have to diet and you don't have to exercise these next 30 days. And you're going to notice a significant difference in your life. Because this is what matters and this is what's missing. All right. Until next time, tribe. 
Be brave, be kind, live authentically, and always shine. Remember, you're only one habit away. Make sure you check the show notes if you like recordings of all this and all the bonuses that go along with it so you get lifetime access to it. Don't forget to go grab that for $50. Um, it's awesome for all the stuff that you get, and you get my daily resources as well. But, of course, this is a free ch- challenge everywhere, so there's no need to if you can't, but I encourage you to do so because uh, that will be gone um, anytime. So, All right, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Reach out to me anytime.